In 2025, the world stands at a pivotal moment in the evolution of conflict, where artificial intelligence has shifted from a supporting tool to a central force shaping modern warfare, redefining strategy, speed, and the very nature of human decision-making. Governments and defense agencies across the globe now rely on AI-driven systems not only to interpret vast fields of data, but also to anticipate threats, deploy resources, and in some cases execute lethal decisions with unprecedented precision and speed. Modern battlefields, physical, digital, and cognitive, have become intertwined in a complex web of sensors, autonomous platforms, and algorithmic prediction engines that operate far faster than any human mind can process. Commanders today oversee environments where drones communicate with drones, robotic ground units coordinate with airborne surveillance networks, cyber defense AIS intercept attacks before soldiers are even aware of them, and misinformation bots shape public perception long before politicians can respond. AI has expanded the battlefield into a persistent, global, always active arena where actions ripple instantly across the mains. Military strategists in 2025 often refer to this transformation as hyperwar, conflict characterized by machine speed operations, multi-domain integration, and the blurring of lines between offense and defense, human and machine, peace and conflict. As AI systems assume more responsibility, ethical questions intensify. Who is accountable when an autonomous drone misidentifies a target? What happens when two opposing AI systems escalate based not on political intent, but algorithmic interpretation? The answers remain unclear, yet nations continue to invest heavily, believing that falling behind in the AI arms race poses even greater risks. One of the most disruptive changes in 2025's AI-driven warfare is the rise of autonomous weapons, machines capable not only of navigating and analyzing the environment, but also selecting and engaging targets without direct human input. These systems, ranging from miniature quadcopters equipped with facial recognition kill protocols to large, unmanned combat aircraft operating as loyal wingmen alongside human pilots, have altered both the scale and nature of conflict. A single operator can now manage swarms of drones acting cooperatively, sharing sensor data, flanking enemy defenses, and executing coordinated attacks. These swarms overwhelm traditional systems with sheer volume and unpredictability, rendering conventional anti-aircraft tactics increasingly obsolete. Military view autonomy as a way to reduce casualties, increase operational reach, and maintain dominance even in highly contested environments. However, autonomy introduces vulnerabilities. Hacked or spoofed AI systems can be turned against their operators, and machine-generated errors can escalate conflicts unintentionally. Thus, while autonomous weapons offer strategic advantages, they demand new doctrines, cybersecurity safeguards, and ethical frameworks to prevent catastrophic misuse. Equally transformative is the rise of AI-driven intelligence and surveillance, which has revolutionized how militaries gather, filter, and act upon information. Modern sensors, from satellites to body-worn cameras, produce immense volumes of real-time data that no human intelligence officer could hope to process. AI systems trained to recognize patterns, anomalies, troop movements, and even emotional cues fill this gap, analyzing battlefield conditions in seconds and generating predictive models that allow decision-makers to act preemptively. These systems fuse data from multiple domains, cyber, space, air, sea, and land, creating a unified operational picture that commanders use to coordinate complex operations. In 2025, AI supports almost every intelligence workflow, identifying targets, forecasting enemy strategies, monitoring social media for signs of unrest or coordinated misinformation, and even detecting subtle indicators of cyber intrusions. The line between national security intelligence and commercial data analytics is blurred, as militaries increasingly rely on AI models originally built for civilian applications, from satellite image classification to behavioral analytics. This enhanced situational awareness makes warfare faster and more precise, but also raises concerns about surveillance overreach and the militarization of civilian data. Meanwhile, cyber warfare has become inseparable from AI, turning cyberspace into one of the most contested battlegrounds of 2025. AI-enhanced cyber tools can probe networks of vulnerabilities, cross sophisticated phishing campaigns, and deploy self-evolving malware designed to bypass traditional defenses. 
Adversaries now launch autonomous cyber operations that adapt in real time, altering tactics when confronted with new security measures. Defenders respond with their own AI-based countermeasures, creating a constant duel between hostile and defensive algorithms. These cyber conflicts rarely occur in isolation. They often support kinetic operations by disabling communication networks, compromising missile defense systems, or tampering with GPS signals used by autonomous weapons. The danger lies in the invisibility and speed of these operations. Nations may not realize they are under attack until infrastructure has already been compromised and attribution is notoriously difficult, raising the risk of miscalculated retaliation. As AI grows more capable, so do fears that malicious actors could automate large-scale cyber attacks, targeting power grids, hospitals, water systems, and the financial sector. This raises urgent questions about global norms, digital resilience, and the role of AI in defending against threats that move at machine speed. Human-machine teaming has become another hallmark of AI warfare in 2025, with soldiers increasingly working alongside AI companions designed to enhance tactical performance, reduce cognitive load, and increase survivability. Augmented reality helmets overlay real-time data on the terrain, marking enemy positions, friendly units, and potential hazards. AI assistants analyze a soldier's health, detect stress or fatigue, and provide strategic recommendations during combat. In armored vehicles and aircraft, AI co-pilots monitor system health, optimize flight paths, suggest evasive maneuvers, and take temporary control when human reaction time is insufficient. This collaboration allows humans to focus on judgment, creativity, and ethical decisions while machines handle processing, targeting, and coordination. Yet this partnership also creates new dependencies. Soldiers may come to trust AI systems too deeply, or conversely, distrust them due to opaque decision-making. Educating troops on how to understand AI behavior, interpret recommendations, and intervene when necessary has become as essential as weapons training. The ultimate goal is not to replace soldiers, but to amplify their capabilities, though not all nations share this philosophy, leading to varied levels of autonomy on the global stage. In 2025, artificial intelligence has not simply updated the tools of war. It has rewritten the rules, forcing nations, soldiers, and citizens to confront difficult questions about power, accountability, and the future conflict. As AI advances, the world stands on the brink of a new era where the pace of warfare accelerates beyond human comprehension, where invisible battles influence visible ones, and where the actions of autonomous systems can alter the fate of nations. Whether AI becomes a force of stability or a catalyst for chaos will depend on the choices humanity makes today, long before future algorithms make choices for us. If you did, make sure like and subscribe to our channel for future updates. See you in the next video.